Hello, you guys. Today we're gonna. I heard somebody preach, and it was real strong. And she preached on how uh, we're justified, and then we're um, sanctified, and then we're glorified. So I'm gonna emphasize on that because a lot of people don't realize. And if you understand that Jesus Christ came for us, our sin nature. When you understand that, then you recognize that you can't lose your salvation. That was the whole purpose. John three sixteen: For God so loved the world that He gave His only begotten Son, that whomsoever believeth in Him shall not perish, but have everlasting life. I'm not here to argue. John nineteen thirty says: So when Jesus has had received the sour wine, He said, "It is finished." Concordance. You know, a strong uh, concordance, which gives you the Greek Hebrew text. Right. 5055, when Jesus says it is finished, that word finished meant this to end, i.e., complete, execute, conclude, discharge the debt. Okay, so now you say, what is finished? That means salvation. Like, there's no more works, like the Old Testament. Okay, so it goes, and we know that all things work together for a good to those who love God, to those who are the called according to his purpose, for whom he foreknew, he also predestined. You know what I'm saying? So it's predestiny, right? Destined, which means already done, to be conformed to the image of his son, that he might be the firstborn of many brethren, right? Moreover, over whom he predestined, which means when you receive Jesus Christ, this is it. He also called, right? So we got to do what he says. And he gives us the power of his Holy Spirit to do it through faith. You got to believe this. And once you start acting and resisting self and start moving in love, I love his acts, and then you'll start seeing the manifestation of God working through you. Right? You go to court, there's a case, and justified, like, done. It's a done deal. Right? Justified means you're not guilty. Done. It's over. Not guilty. Remember what we just read about um, it's finished? That's what that means. So, and whom he justified, he also glorified. Which means you're going to be raised... And you're gonna get a new body, going to be with no sin. All sin gonna be in the study, and so that because and don't be ashamed of it. You know, suck it up and say, okay, I taught that and I spoke that, but now I'm gonna teach a new thing and use that. Let God use that to draw many, because there's many in captivity thinking they lose their salvation, and you can't. 